Hey everybody, welcome back. Local workers with Immigration and Customs Enforcement are planning to move their office here in the Hub City from downtown to an area in North Lubbock near some local businesses. But some of those business owners aren't too thrilled about the move. KMAX Tori Larned has more. Every now and then our office staff works uh, maybe a couple hours later. We just don't feel safe around that environment. When Jimmy Farr first heard a customs processing center was being considered near his business in May, he worried about the safety of his employees. After we met the owners of the building, uh, they assured us that there was not going to be uh, any detainees kept overnight. This is an office space. That's really all it is. There's no jail cells. Um, this is a processing location. Um, no one's held here overnight. City Council ultimately voted against the new building when it first appeared on the agenda in May, siding with the Zoning and Planning Committee who advised against it. The proposed specific use would have a negative impact on the adjacent properties. The level of security would be much higher than what is existing in surrounding areas. Now that it's back on the agenda, other community members worry about the negative impact it could have on local businesses. But the property owner only thinks it could help. But I think in that particular area, we just desperately need to revitalize it. We're going to spend five hundred thousand dollars renovating this. Eighteen new jobs are going to be created at this location. And with a larger facility, Danielle Delilo also worries about the increased presence of ice in the city. Then we've got you know, 10 cities going on and all of this other stuff. And until we kind of get that sorted out, you want to make sure that Lubbock is being as hospitable to everybody as possible. Tori Larned, KMAC News. Thanks so much, Tori. So that brings us straight to this week's poll question. Are you in favor of the ICE facility moving out of the federal building to a new location? What do you think? You can vote on our KMAC News Facebook page and on everythinglubbock.com. Comment your thoughts in the comments section and click on talking points to give us your opinion. Stick around. We're coming right back with a look at the week ahead. At Glasheen Bio